I'm Blake and I'm a PM nerd. I'm going to be talking with you about CA Technologies Clarity Agile. This application is part of a set of products designed to support product innovation. Go ahead and take a seat and we'll get started. We've talked a lot about this model in the other Clarity Suite sessions. Clarity Agile sits here and mainly provides support for the launch definition pillar. Yes, it supports an Agile development methodology, but it can also be used to support waterfall and other traditional development processes. If you are considering any type of iterative development, this might be what you're looking for. This is another very feature-rich software tool, and like Clarity requirements, we won't have time to cover everything. Let's pick three topics you feel are most important to you now. Manage the product backlog. Sprint planning. Tracking and monitoring status. Sprint planning, product backlog, tracking and monitoring status. Okay, these three topics will get things going. Let's start with the first item we wanted to check out, sprint planning. Using Agile Vision, we can plan tasks to coordinate schedules while balancing costs with quality. Each user story and sprint backlog is broken down into tasks that need to be completed to deliver the story. We can assign resource teams and task owners to each task and estimate the number of hours to complete the task. As time goes on, you can log time against the task and see remaining effort. The burn down charts for the sprint show me how much work has been completed and where we are in relation to the guideline which represents steady progress. While planning the sprint, the allocation charts can be used to see available resources and their utilization, minimizing resource risk and overutilization. So do you feel that this method of sprint planning could be implemented by your team? Funny, this is exactly the way we do it, but you've automated it. Also, the support in the tool makes it so everyone will be doing it the same, and we will all know what to expect from each other. The resource allocation chart will really help my team avoid putting too much in the sprint for any one person, and balance the work across the team. I might have missed it. How does Clarity Agile handle user stories that are too big for one sprint, sometimes referred to as epics? Each epic can be decomposed into smaller stories as we maintain the product backlog. Let's continue to the next topic and see how we work with the product backlog. Manage and maintain the DEEP qualities of the product backlog to enhance adoption of prioritized features. DEEP stands for Detailed Appropriately, Estimated, Emergent, and Prioritized. Each story in the product backlog is prioritized against the others so that they can be planned into sprints. As you change the rank of one, it automatically reorders the rest of the backlog. In the product backlog, you can also see dependencies among user stories. In this case, user story 99 is a prerequisite for the story and would need to be planned into the same sprint. In the backlog, we can see the status of each story, the estimated story points, and plan them into releases and sprints. For collaboration, you can choose them to follow certain stories, giving you updates and the ability to participate in discussions about the story. Some stories are related to epics, which are shown in this view as well. Many times, epics are used to capture a large story that is eventually broken down and refined into multiple smaller user stories that can fit into a sprint. From this view, you can create new stories for the epic or create new tasks for those stories. The epics hierarchy also gives you the ability to view the status of all the stories and tasks related to an epic across any number of sprints and releases. What did DEEP stand for? Detailed appropriately, estimated, emergent, and prioritized. There are a lot of ways to manage your backlog, but we found that what Mike Cohn teaches about the backlog to be spot on. Did you all see how Clarity Agile helps manage the deep characteristics of the backlog? It does, but I also saw how important it was for us to do our job right. There's not much the tool can do if we don't get things detailed appropriately. Yes, there's some truth to what you're saying, but when we go into the tool deeper, I'll show you some things the tool can do to help. For now, is everyone ready to move on? Do you feel confident in the support of the backlog? Great, then let's continue with the last topic we wanted to discuss, tracking and monitoring status. We can use project oversight to anticipate and resolve issues while ensuring expectations are aligned. The home page shows all tasks assigned to me and their current status, so from one view I can see exactly what I need to be working on. The virtual wall is used to collaborate with sprint team members on tasks. It shows all tasks for a story and their progress. Tasks are color-coded by type, such as design, QA, or documentation. In the daily scrum or stand-up, tasks and their impediments can be identified, discussed, and reviewed. 
This collaborative environment enables the team to quickly resolve issues. The dashboard allows me to see my team's velocity for a given sprint compared to others. Viewing the burn down chart allows me to see the current status of a sprint and how much of the planned work has been completed. If I see issues, I can dive into that sprint backlog and see the stories and tasks that are incomplete as well as any impediments that need to be addressed. The dashboards are customizable so that you can view the details of any sprint or release you need information about. These can also be useful during the sprint retrospective and seeing how we did, and discussing things we can do differently to avoid issues we ran into. Exactly. Agile Vision gives you the project oversight both during and after sprints to resolve issues and align expectations. Today you've been shown some of the value of Clarity Agile through sprint planning, product backlog, tracking, and monitoring within this tool. I hope you take the time to view some of the other sessions which go deeper into specific objectives. Well, that's all the time we have for today. Remember, PM nerds wake up each morning and transform themselves for greater competitive advantage.